We have a very special thing that, uh, that we're adding to the store today. Uh, this is something that I really think was really incredibly done. Um, this is Teresa Artiguez. She uh, is a wonderful photographic artist. Just started doing uh, painting. Uh, this is one of her first paintings that she decided to do, and that's of me in doing my craft that I love so much. And uh, that's baking bread, uh, something that I started at a young age. And I take, obviously, everyone that knows Joe Leone can take a great uh, pride of our bread. We started out as a bread bakery back in 1997. So, Teresa, would you like to say something before we unveil the, uh, the new piece of art that's going to be displayed here in our store? Sure. Um, I just love painting this because I want to portray the person that Joe is and what he, how he became where he is today. And I incorporated um, him doing something instead of just portrait of his, you know, looking at the camera or smiling or whatever. Um, I wanted to capture him and his essence, and you'll see that in a minute. And I also put in little um, personal touches. We all know how important that is. Forget about me. I love you. Okay. Um, and then also, I, you know, I really love the fact that there's nothing on here of Joe Leone's because it's more of a personal type of uh, outlook. And then also, the original mixer is behind. Okay, that's very emotional to me. Also, um, one of the things that I uh, truly believe is the most recognized logo in the world, and that's the crucifix. And that, that's right over by my heart all the time, every day. So I think that that's a great uh, depiction of, of that, that great logo that's so powerful in the world. Um, and why don't you explain what else you did? I also added in, thank you. <laughs> I also, um, throughout my paintings now, I'm adding little personal touches by putting like something significant that means something to the, the actual person. And I chose to put in Pasquale here on the bowl because that means a lot to Joe. I was really, I was really taken back by this, this one thing where uh, Teresa really got in deep about a lot of my history, about my work ethic, and, and building the business since I was 21 years old. And one of the, one of the people I can contribute a lot of my work ethic to is my grandfather Pasquale. My grandfather Pasquale was an immigrant from Italy. Uh, came here, was probably one of the hardest human beings, hardest working human beings I've ever met in my life. Uh, very disciplined. My grandfather wasn't the type that, I love you, go play baseball. It was about work and survival. He was very, uh, very indignant about our work ethic that we have uh, in our family, and he was very proud of the work that we were able to do. We, you know, never, he never used to call in contractors for his properties. We would figure out how to do it ourselves, and, he, he was a great person uh, when it came to showing great work ethic. That's one thing that he left here. And he also gave me the American dream. Uh, him, him also with my grandparents, uh, you know, coming here uh, to this country uh, and to give me this wonderful opportunity as an American. Uh, I remember my grandfather telling me that if he would have stayed in Italy, I would be picking olives and almonds off of trees. And I was able to do something that I was passionate about. And I, I have a cousin that's a, a cousin that's going to be a doctor. He's going to have a doctor in Trona uh, next to her name. My cousin Alana. My uh, other cousin, he is uh, he's in the banking industry. I have my other cousin that's in the marketing industry. And it's just amazing to see the, the generations coming on. And also, I have an uncle that's a successful nightclub owner. My other uncle was an athletic director, owned the, owned the gym. Uh, my father owned his own business. Uh, you can see. Uh, when you see my father Ralph around here, you can see how dedicated and hardworking he is. That's uh, my aunt. My aunt Joanne is uh, just a, a very hard worker. She works uh, work for US Air. Now it's like in United. She's been there for over 40 something years. So we've always take our work very seriously, and it, and it started with him. And my grandmother Vincenzo is a hard worker also. Uh, so that was a very personal thing. And when Teresa uh, first presented this, uh, these paintings with other paintings. 
I was blown away by seeing my grandfather's name. Um, that night, my uncle posted on Facebook, that was actually the 15th anniversary that day of him passing. Uh, so it really, it really took me back. Like it was like something that was meant to be that day. So I uh, thank you for the experience, um, and uh, it's just uh, outstanding. And this will be here for the lifetime of uh, Joey Ellis. So thank you, Teresa. I appreciate you coming. All right, let's get to work. It's holiday season. Keep on going, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.